what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel today what we'll be talking about is how to get mods onto content manager uh, specifically drift mods and I know there's a lot of videos out there on how to do it but I mean I uh, I didn't really find any like drift focused ones uh, there probably is but I don't know I'll, I'll just put my two cents in and show you how to if you're if you really like drifting and that's kind of all you do then and not like racing or anything um, then I'll show you kind of how to do it where to get it from and the easiest way to transfer mods into the content manager and get drifting real quick this is specifically if you have content manager um, it makes it so much easier than the normal set of course uh, uh, game um, I don't know it's just everything is so much more easy to use it's more thought out there's more options more features more adjustments it's just a lot better just literally google content manager content manager set of corsa bada beam bada boom um yeah just a set of corsa dot club that's a good it's a reputable site um and then it'll just you know scroll all the way down and you'll hit uh download light version but you know definitely this is a work of art guys so if you want to donate uh to the to the creators i personally have it i probably should <laughs> uh but definitely you can just download the light version which is free just to kind of try it out and then if you really like it then you donate down here so i just did download directly and then um you just unpack it load it in install it boom once you have content manager what you want to do is open up a web page um, so I'll show you a couple sites that I use uh, that a lot of people use um, I'm sure there's a lot more that I'm gonna list but here's a couple good ones to, to just start on to get some mods and you know learn the ropes so acdriftingpro.com um, it's a pretty good one I'll leave the link in the description in case you don't want to type it you can just click on it sometimes I notice that it's it's either down or there's like a link that doesn't work or something but most of the time it's good so they have most of everything that's well I don't know about all but they have a lot of like drift focused cars which is cool um, like you get Adam LZ's car you can get whole packs uh, which I'll show you you do packs and this will show you Bushido style car pack, the um, the WTT WDT pack, which I personally like, uh, ADC Aussie Drift Co Tando Buddies. This is going to be a big one. A lot of car packs and or a lot of tracks require Tando Buddies cars. Um, SQDC I like this one. Um, Toge Workshop is a good one. Uh, what else? Lone Star is also good. DTP pack. That's this is another big one that a lot of people use the cars from. Um, so you want to get those different clubs. Blah blah blah. There's tracks too. Tracks are good. You want to get tracks. But yeah. So check out this website here. Um, now the next one would be Race Department. Race Department is pretty good as well. Now they're more focused for grip racing or rally car, or they have a bunch of other games too. Um, like they support like all of the motorsport games um, obviously except Forza but everything else like R Factor, Wreckfest, Ride, R uh, what did I say? Did I say R Factor already? I think I did. I just a set of course of Dirt, F1. So you want to go to a set of course of tab where you're going to find that is if you're at this is the home screen here you go to downloads and then on the categories list you'll see a set of course of and then you can go through these. The main one would be AC cars, a set of course of cars. Now I have a hard time finding like drift mods. Um, yeah, I I don't really know how to filter by drift. So what I do is I just Google like Ando buddies car pack. And then, okay, never mind. Well, um, okay, don't do that. <laughs> the race department is like okay. Um, they have good tracks. They're good tracks that you can try. Um, and just explore that. But yeah, a lot of times I find the links like just in Google searches, and then it'd be from race department. So, um, 
I don't use this site often, but it is, it's a good site, try it out. The next one would be like APOD, AIPODDRIFTERS.COM. This is, I've actually never used the site, but I've heard good things about it. Um, I've read that a lot of people use it too. Yeah, so you just download there. And they have all of the major like VDC. Um, yeah, that's all the, all the basic ones. Check out AI Pod Drifters. Next one would be like Lone Star Seto. So Lone Star, as you may know, is like the, uh, I don't know what they're called, a community or a full team, but I don't know. Lone Star Seto is a good one. Um, yeah, they have their real life drifting and also their sim drifting. So they have sim equipment for sale. They have PCs they can buy. They have gear, then all your downloads. So where you want to go, or you can join the Discord, but downloads, and then you can download their cars, and it'll take you to a Google Drive folder with a bunch of different packs of the VDC, Tano Buddies, um, the Winter Drift Pack, the VDT. Yeah, so there's a bunch of packs included with that. Same with tracks, same, same. You just, like, they have a bunch. This is probably all every track that you'll need pretty much to, <laughs> to for a setup um, alright so that's that's another one the last one I want to talk about or like these are the main ones that I kind of that I pretty much use oh now I think about it I only use AC Drifting Pro Race Department sometimes and this right here so this one this is a link um, a Google Docs link that I don't know who made it um, I might say it on here somewhere but so I'll put this link in the or I'll put all the links in the description below but this is a whole guide a drifting guide um, for everything for a set of Corsa drifting like if you're into drifting and you're on a set of Corsa and you have content manager boom this is this is everything that you need so here's all the like uh, updates that they're currently working on and as you can see they're pretty recent like March 16th so I'm recording this on the 17th um, but yeah this is yesterday and they have, still have stuff coming out so it's cool they keep us updated so car packs this has every car pack pretty much that you'll ever need like there's probably other smaller car packs out there that people you know make privately but these are all like the big ones there's probably more than enough than you need but car packs whole track list like if someone were to be like, hey, go get a Sonoma, then you could look up Sonoma, boom, and then you click on the link, and then boom, you download it. Like you just hit download. But let me, I'll show you that in just a minute. Um, or you could download these individually. Like if you're like, oh, I just want, the, um, I just want, I don't know, I just want the new Supra, like without any without downloading the whole pack, you just download the new Supra, boom, okay this looks sketchy, but I think I did this, but it was fine, <laughs> um, I think they monitor all these links and make sure that there's no viruses and shit, but don't quote me on that, if you get a virus, I'm not liable, um, but look at this, a freaking E36 wagon wide body with the SR20, and this E36 front S13, bro, doesn't get much better than that. So these are just random cars, and then they have like all the packs individually. So ADC pack is gonna be like one of my favorites, I think. The Aussies know how to do it, man. The Aussies know. But this is all the, the whole pack. If you want to download it, all you do. So it looks like they have two separate packs available. So find the link. Like normally it says like download or you know whatever as a as a link. So you click on that, and then boom, you get all of that. So just kind of going through these, like BCGP, like look at that freaking STI drift car, like <laughs> the possibilities are endless. Drift Workshop, Wise Fab, um, Gorilla Mod, The Lone Star, SQDC. I love the C46. The thing is wicked. Um, Tano Buddies right here, boom. Um, Titan, Titan's cool. VDC. The VDC is a hard pack, like. They look amazing, but they're for me for some reason it's a really hard. I guess I might, I 
I've only tried like a couple cars, so I should probably try other ones, but they are hard cars to master. Um, WDT, these cars are a lot easier. Um, WDT, I need to try like this wagon, it looks so fun. Um, but yeah, check out this link uh, for this whole thing, the guide, it's amazing. And so now what I'll do is I will show you real quick on how to install install a car into content manager so pick a car pick any car that you want and i'm gonna pick adam lz's car because i don't have it yet um looks like he they have two files of it an sr20 version and a 2j version i think this includes both files so we're gonna hit download this file we're gonna hit download it's gonna begin 30 seconds i think if you pay for the premium version then it it downloads immediately and then there's like other perks for it but you gotta pay and I don't want to pay so we're going to wait for this to download all right so once that countdown goes down then you'll come to this screen here just go and hit the download button download anyway no download all right so now once this is download here uh, what we're gonna do is we will kind of do a split screen action here so you can literally like this is the easiest way to do this is um, just drag it drag it over here drop it in and you'll see that this this thing here started to download and it will auto install without without you having to extract the file in your own computer so this will automatically extract it automatically install it and you have to hit install but that's about it you hit install boom it's done so now let's make this full screen and then once you once you get once you, once that is done installing holy shit um then you can go to your car list um wait what was the file called oh okay so it, it's all alphabetical it should be right here yes sir and boom so I think this is the SR version and this is the 2j version I think it says somewhere too maybe not it also shows your horsepower so yeah the SR is 345 horsepower and then 2j is 535 then all you gotta do here we'll do yeah Pat's acres find park then you go select it do the 2j you hit ok and then set your weather conditions and hit go um and that's that's basically it <laughs> that's how you do that it's the same exact process with tracks too except for example like la canyons or um, what was it i think the the aussie drift aussie drift land is also a little bit different but that's that's gonna do it guys that's that's about all you need to do is drag and drop um i'll leave the links for all of these websites and this link here all in the description so uh, that way you guys can have access to it and you guys can get started and the drifting community can grow even more because that would be sick to have more people on the servers um yeah i hope you guys like this video hope this helped and let me know if you have any questions in the comments. I'll try to get back to you. Um, and um, yeah, see you until next time. See ya.